Bacia! Bacia! Lu, bati! Lu, bati! Lu, bati, mulau! It was one of those times where we've been grinding day, night, day, night, and it was the last day, the last night iteration, and um, you know, everyone was tired. Everyone was starting to drone out. Everyone needed a little motivational bump, a little, little pick me up. I am Captain Jordan Scanlon. I'm an American Samoan native, and I am a commander in Lancer Brigade, HHC 117. Are you ready? When you're born in American Samoa, you're born uh, a U.S. national, which is exactly the same as a U.S. citizen. It, you just can't vote for the president. To me, the benefit of that title is we maintain a very strong sense of nation, sense of self with the United States, while also maintaining an incredibly powerful and unwavering passion for being Samoan and never truly feeling as if we have lost our culture or anything like that. In American Samoa, there are very few ways to, you know, quote unquote, get off the rock, like we say. You either play football or you join the military. It's common because our culture and the military have so many parallels. Culturally, we have a tremendous respect for our elders, but it's also a culture of, of love and respect and compassion and all, all attributes and things that you need to be a successful leader in the military. I am a descendant of chiefs. My whole family, the Scanlon family, is a pretty large Samoan family. My grandmother, she had the high chief title of Kumaru. Definitely not the highest, but certainly, certainly up there. And her talking chief was my dad. His chief title was Ali Mao. And he was the talking chief for high chief Kumaru. So I've got a couple items here that are kind of unique to my culture. They're all related to being a chief. So this one, this one is uh, the Ula Fala. Uh, the ula fala is just one of many types of, of ulas that we wear or like necklaces in it and it would kind of go on like this typically worn by by either a high chief or a talking chief of the village for ceremonial purposes church funerals weddings that type of stuff the uh, second item i brought this one here this one's called the fue and the fue just like the ula is again it's worn or used for ceremonial purposes. This one less less common than the uh, ula, um, but it's kind of used in conjunction with this other item here. And this is the ko'oko, right? Or like it's a talking chief staff, I guess loosely translated. And the way they kind of work is the talking chief will kind of hold it up and they'll bend his arm and hold it like this and he'll have the fue on, on his side. And as he's talking to the villagers or to his, you know, um, those who leads in the religious family members, there's, they'll kind of do this. And, and the so cultural significance of this, honestly, is just a just a thing and a part of that movement is a part of, you know, call it the, the heuristics or the speech patterns of being a chief. And it's important because it's they are the symbols of, of being a chief. There are three types of chiefs in our culture, right? There's the high chief who can also have all of these things. There's the talking chief who typically does have a ko, -ko uh, right? Because he is the, the voice of the high chief. All right, and then, uh, and then you just have, you know, chiefs. You know, think of it as XO first sergeant commander. We had a popular kind of video here in the unit, and everyone thinks it's the Hakka, right? The Hakka. Hakka is awesome, love it, but that's actually a, a Maori thing. It's, that's not a Samoan. Samoans have, I guess, if you guys do a one for one Hakka, you know, for New Zealand, and then the, the Samoan equivalent, you could probably be the Siva Samoa, uh, which is a lot more jovial, kind of like a lot of hopping around. But there's also the Fa'aluma, and the Fa'aluma is, I think, loosely translated as conductor, but it's basically the, the person who's up in front of the village with his people and, and, and starts to chant. And that's what we kind of did in the, the kind of, call it, I guess, viral video. So we did the Fa'aluma, and, and it's basically where the guy comes up and he kind of rubs his hands, he's like, me, 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 me
Uh, Luo Pati. Luo Pati. Luo Pati Maleo. Oh! And everyone just kind of does that. And then we did a Faumu at the end, which is like the choo Like the, the war cry. Yeah, that, that's what we did. And it was, it was just kind of like right time, right place, right moment. <laughs>